Hello everyone. In this video we are going to see how to create your own function or user defined function using Google Apps Script. So if you take about a Google Sheet, it has uh, nearly thousands of uh, inbuilt function and if you feel that this function are uh, not meet your requirement or you want to create your own function and Google has given a provision to create or define your own function with the help of Apps Scripts and that is what we are going to see today. So to open a script editor you have to go to tools and script editor script editor will be opened in a new window like this so you have to define your function here so let's create a function for multiplication so if you type a word multiply so there is a one function which is already available it's an inbuilt function and it gives the product of two number so let's create a function to give the product of three numbers so we will name this function as multiply 3 so this is a function name for our user defined function and the function should starts with should enclose within this uh, curly braces and it should have two parentheses open and close parenthesis and inside this parenthesis you have to give the input or what is the argument that you are going to pass inside this custom function so I'm going to pass three input that is product of three numbers to get the product of three numbers it should accept three input so let's name this as num1 num2 and num3 and what is the output that is this function is going to return that you have to define inside this curly braces so it's going to return the product of three number you have to type it as num1 asterisk num2 and num3 so this is a, just a simple function which is going to give the product of three number let's test this function in the google sheet so all the function starts with an as assignment operator or equal to symbol followed by the function name and open a parenthesis give three numbers close the parenthesis and click enter so now you can see that it gives the product of three numbers that is 234 the product of uh, 234 is 24 so this function is working as expected and if you type the function name in the google sheet you can see that our function is not listed on the autocomplete feature to list the custom function in the Google Sheet, you have to define that in the Google Apps Script. So open a comment section and let's give the description about this function to get the product of three numbers. So this is a short description of this custom function and you have to use the tag name called custom function. So if you use this uh, tag name then it will automatically be listed in the autocomplete feature of Google Sheet. Let's check that one. Just save this one and click. So you can see that multiply 3 that is our uh, custom function is included in the autocomplete which I've typed this one you can see the summary here whatever the description which we have given here is shown in the summary section to get the product of three numbers and what is the input that is going to accept is listed here so if you want to define or give a description for this three input you can do so using a tag name called param at param followed by argument name followed by the description enter the first number let's say enter the first number and we can use the same for the other two let's save this one and just double click to refresh this one at param there is a small typo it's at param let's save this one and refresh this one now you can see that multiply three num1 num2 num3 and summary here uh, num1 
after the num1 you can see the description as enter the first number and same for num2 and num3 so this is how you can define your own function and let me show you one thing so this is a one function that i have created to get the price or uh, cryptocurrency price using an api script so i'm not going to explain this one because i have already created a video on how to call an external api that you can see it on the notification icon if you just click on this it, you can see that video and let's see how this work so if you want to get the price of any cryptocurrency you can use a formula of crypto price and inside the double quotes you have to give the cryptocurrency name let's say ripple and click on enter you can see the price uh, current price of ripple in a google sheet it's get imported from coin market cap website so this is how you can define your own function and if you want this function there is whatever the function which you have written inside this google script if you want this uh, function to be listed or to be included on other google sheet there are actually two ways one is you have to copy the script you have to copy the script and paste it paste the same script in all other google sheet that you want to use this function where you want to use uh, the custom function or you you you, should, you have to publish this as an add-on and you can import that add-ons from this section add-ons get add-ons you can type your add-on what, what is the if you publish the add-on you have to give your name and give the same name here to import that add-on so these are the two ways where you can use your uh, custom or user defined function in all other google sheet so that's it and i have created a patreon page for my youtube channel if you want to support you can extend or you can support me and the link is given in the description if you like this video give thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel thank you bye bye